takes place on ceramic tiles. It's kind of an open flame situation, which then radiates the infrared energy. And because this is a high efficiency and high intensity heaters, they can heat from up to 180 feet. So you typically will find these outdoors. Okay, you rarely see these indoors. As a matter of fact, I don't think I've ever seen one indoor. With tube heaters, the combustion takes place in the tube, and the tube uh, is where the radiation occurs. So they work at lower temperatures, and then you know they could heat up to about 50 feet. So why, how is this different than conventional type heaters? Well, typical unit heater, you have a heat source like an electric strip heater or a gas burner, and you have a fan that blows forced air over it, and you're heating the air and you're blowing that air into this space. Okay, so back to infrared heaters. So let's break down the process in a little more detail. So power source. So commercial infrared heaters 